Okay, in this video we're going to have a look at how we can use um, text-to-speech programs in order to take a poem that's on Word and change it into an MP3. In a later video we're then going to put that into Audacity, mix it with a background piece of music in order to make our own song. Anyway, here we go. We've got a Word document open. It's got an AI-generated poem called The Station. And I'm not going to read it out. I'm going to get um, a text-to-speech program to do that. Now, we're going to use two different ones today. We're going to use freetts.com, and we're also going to use Narrakeet. And it doesn't really matter which you use. They both work reasonably well. So, first thing, go onto my poem. Hold Control and A to select everything. Control and C to copy everything. I'm just going to minimize that now. And then Control V and we can paste it into here. You'll see there's a maximum number of characters. I've used 928, but there's 5,000 available, so that's okay. And there's a range of languages we can try here. So if I just try this one with English United States, and it should give us different options. I can have like a 36 year old female. This is what Emma sounds like. Treats is a free online services offering. That's what Ava sounds like. Fritz is a free online. Doesn't really matter. Choose one that you like. Let's try Nancy. Fritz is a free online service. Let's go with that one. Okay, so I'll select Nancy here. I've selected the age here. We've just said it's in English. And I'm going to press convert text to speech. It may take a few seconds to go through and do that for us. We'll bear with it. Now, once it's actually finished, we're going to need to download and save this file because we're going to need it later when we put it into Audacity. Quite a lot of text in here, so it might take a few more seconds. So let's sit down to the last 12 characters. Okay, now let's try and play it. Press play. The station. In Paris, 31, where history weaves. Montparnasse station in morning's breeze. Black and white hues paint a silent scene. Okay, so we could play all the way through that, but you don't need to hear my AI-generated poem. You can try this with your own. All I need to do now is I need to click on the download button. Might take a second to generate this. Or two. And I'm just going to call it, well, my poem is called The Station, so I'm going to call it The Station. And because this one came from Free TTS, I'm going to recognize that by writing that in. So it says The Station Free TTS, and it's saving it as an MP3 file. I'm going to press Save there. Now I'm going to do the same thing with Narrowkey. So exactly the same thing. Paste in our text. The voice at the moment is set to Beatrice. Again, we've got a range of different voices on here. We could have Nelson, Alfred, Spencer, Pamela is a Canadian one. Doesn't really matter. Go down to Let's try Rose. She's from New Zealand. Now, from memory on this one, I don't think we can test it until we've actually run it. So let's press Create Audio. You can watch the narrakeet or parakeet flying along while it generates it. Okay, now let's press play. The station in Paris, 31, where history weaves, Montparnasse station in morning's breeze. Black and white hues paint a silent scene, where echoes of travelers past convene. As okay, I quite like that one, so I'm going to keep both of those. I'm going to press download, and again I'm going to save it. This one's going to be called the station in Paris, that's okay, and we're going to call it Narrow Keats. Again, so I can recognize where it came from. Now, if I wasn't happy with that, we can just press for return to the previous page. And instead of having rows, we could choose somebody else. We could press create audio again. It's slightly easier on free TTS because you can sample the sound before you start. But Narrakeet does actually code it quite quickly, so it doesn't matter. 
The only thing to watch out for is there is a maximum number of times you can do this before you can uh, before you have to pay. So I've got 18 more attempts, but that's plenty for what we want today. The station. In Paris, 31, where history weaves, Montparnasse Station. It's got a nice South African accent. Download that one as well. So I'm going to call that Narakit, but afterwards I'm going to put ZA, which is the code for South Africa. Okay, I've now got three versions of this, and I can try those in Audacity at the next stage of this. <laughs> 